The book of Genesis talks about a global flood, but most of the evolutionary community and most of the scientists in the world say there never was a global flood. It was all maybe just a local flood at best. Maybe it just flooded the Middle East. But what really happened? Was this flood real? Is there evidence for this flood? People ask me all the time, where's the evidence of a global flood? And I tell people, just look down. Most people are standing on a location on the earth where there's thousands of feet of flood deposit sediments filled with millions and billions of fossils. But why do people say that it was just a local flood or there was no flood at all? Because those people are coming from an evolutionary worldview where they don't want to believe there ever was a flood. They don't want to believe God's Word talks about a global flood in the book of Genesis. When you look at the layers, it can either be thousands of feet of sediment deposited over millions of years or thousands of feet of sediment deposited in the year of the flood. It can't be both. I spent the last 10 years at ICR compiling data across six continents of the world. And all those continents show the same pattern of a progressive flood. Every continent has the same order of burial, same sort of fossils at the same time. As the water went higher and higher, more we see more and more coverage. And ultimately, we see a peak of the flood all at the same time all over the world. How do you explain that? unless it's a global flood. Join me as we examine the rocks across the world that confirm that God's word is true.